Hi friends, welcome to another interesting video of video transition. So uh, in this uh, video, I will tell you a very interesting and a very trending uh, video transition that you can use in your blogs or in your projects and anywhere you like. So it's a very cool and a very easy to make video transition that uh, you can make and you can you know uh, use it in anywhere between two videos that you like. So uh, let's get started. This is Dhruv and welcome to my channel. So friends, like you can see, I have used two video clips in this uh, my project and uh, you can see this beautiful transition between them. It's a very simple transition and today I'm going to uh, tell you how to make this simple transition. So uh, let's quickly start this video. So what we'll do is I'll just pause it and uh, I'll just show it to you. We'll uh, use a new composition that I'm taking in HD format and uh, I'll import these two video clips these two clips of forest these are my two video clips so this is the this is I've created two clips in which I want my transition to be placed in between so now what I'll do is I'll just uh, use it's a very simple and very you know it's a very quick uh, video transition uh, I'll use a adjustment layer, I'll take a new adjustment layer and after taking this adjustment layer what I'll do is I'll just uh, uh, give an effect as transform I'll just put this effect on the adjustment layer in this I can you know move the position and that will reflect on both the layers you know behind my adjustment layer so I have these two layers one of this video and one is the second video so I have uh, used transform onto my adjustment layer and now what I'll do is I'll use another effect as CC Reptile and I'll use it on my adjustment layer now what I'll do is now if I want to shift my video like this so there's a transparent or a black background coming coming here. This will be get this will be, uh, corrected through CC Reptile. So there are like uh, three to four parameters. We have expand right, we have expand left, expand down and up. So now I want to expand right because I have shifted my footage to my left hand side. I'll just move this footage like this towards my left hand side so we have two keyframes here I'll just reduce the you know just make these closer to each other so that I have a fast effect to be I'll just check on the motion blur in this and let's check it out right so now you have seen the, like there is a black in between these two so there must be <coughs> some gap yes there is a gap so what what i'll do is i'll just fill this gap and uh, to make this more seamless what i'll do is i'll mark a opacity keyframe here and i'll mark a zero keyframe here at the starting of the second clip so what i'll do is uh, now when the clip is uh, changing there is a slight di dissolve effect in between the two see so now uh, one thing more we just want to uh, correct is that we have this bar in between this black line in between that is due to we've used this effect as cc reptile on my adjustment layer i've used this cc reptile this because of this so to rectify this uh, what i'll do is i'll just make these i'll just copy these two video layers and i'll make all select all these three layers including my adjustment layer and pre-compose into another layer and i'll just paste these two video layers beneath the pre-comp layer so now you can see that there is no black line in between in fact we have tweaked the effect now what I'll do is I'll just 
make this a bit fast so I'll just reduce the length of the effect and let's check it out again see so now I'll just check on the motion blur here also in this decomp layer and now we have this beautiful transition with the motion blur So guys if you want to you know if you want that these reps should be more then what you can do is you can come here and uh, we can shift our position more towards the left hand side and now since there is a black again so we can increase the expand right here more towards the right hand side. Now there is this again black line. So we need to shift more towards the left again and we'll just match this onto our screen. And shift this expand right more like this. So we have this fast moving reps now and uh, I'll come in our main composition wherein I have kept these two video layers behind the peak of one so that I can I cannot see the black line in between them so now let's just preview it again so we have this fast motion happening right now initially we had just only one or two reps now I had increased the reps you can increase it as, as per your like and uh, so you have this fast motion transition with you right now and for this you can increase again shorten up the length of the transition if you want let's check it out again see perfect so now we have such a fast uh, motion transition between them see these type of effects you know you usually get in the transition packs that you get that you get uh, over the internet but uh, this is like how do we create them so this is how to we create the effects so guys uh, this is the transition that we had made and uh, hope you like this video if you like this video please give a thumbs up on this video and please subscribe my channel and look out for more transition effects in near future thank you so much